to Ondo State, where the Minister of Works, David Mai, says importation of bitumen is putting more pressure on the Naira, hence the need for the use of concrete pavement roads. He stated this when he visited the Ondo State Acting Governor, Loki Aida Tiwa, as part of his inspection tour of federal roads in the southwestern part of the country. Ayode Jimurade, your reports. In continuation of his inspection tour of federal roads in the southwest zone of Nigeria, the Minister of Works, Dave Umayi, paid a visit to the acting governor of Undo State, Loki Ayedatiwa. Accompanied by top officials in the ministry, the minister said Nigerians will see more of concrete pavement on roads. According to him, any road construction project that is no more than 20% in execution will be redesigned to concrete pavement road. The minister pointed out that bitumen imported in the 1950s and 1960s have better quality than what obtains now. He added that all road projects awarded three years ago are due for review due to soaring prices of materials in the market. In overseas, you see a lot of roads that are built on concrete with a shelf life of 50 years. But there is no asphalt work here, especially in south, south, southeast and southwest. Even if it's done by Beja. The Beja home may not last more than 15 years. But beside them are some other giant uh, contractors. You see jobs that are still ongoing, that are all gone by. And that's why we're going around and then redesigning a couple of roads. On mm -hmm. this part, the acting it's government nice. said most of the federal roads in the state are either deteriorating or poorly maintained. Your Excellency, some of these roads have either deteriorated or left poorly maintained, while many have suffered severe degradation. It is noteworthy to mention that the intervention of the governor of those state, Alakun, of this state, is principally what has made these roads maintain their present motorable state. The minister also visited the Adwe Kiti Akure Road construction project initiated by the immediate past administration. Aide Moradeyo, TVC News, Akure.